What is going on, guys? Chris here of Chris Collects bringing you another video. And we have one up box for the month of June. Now, if I remember correctly, one up box last month was kind of subpar. If I remember correctly, I could be wrong. Um, I think it was. I can't remember exactly what the theme was last month, but yeah. Oh, yeah, because last month was that Assassin. Was it Assassin's? What was it? I just remember there was a, that Assassin's Creed bear t shirt that I wasn't really fond of. I don't remember what the rest of the stuff was. But, um, anyway. Month of June. Let's pop it over and see what we got. Okay. Pretty, pretty happy with the first thing I see here because I needed this and I haven't picked them up yet. Booker DeWitt Funko Pop. From Bioshock Infinite. Uh, I have Songbird. Never got around to picking up Booker or Elizabeth, so that's pretty cool. Mm, you know, that's a great thing. All right, then we got a t-shirt. There's a dinosaur on it. So it's a crossover of The Walking Dead and Jurassic Park. So you got a dinosaur there. You got Daryl, obviously. I'm not sure who that's supposed to be with the shotgun on her back. Um... I really don't know who that's supposed to be. Um, I don't know. Not really a huge fan of the shirt. It could have been cool if like the T-Rex looked more like zombified, but he just looked like a normal T-Rex. So, uh, whatever. Um, you have a little key cover that's got Daryl Dixon's jacket with the angel wings on it. That's kind of cool. Um... Got a card in here that's totally destroyed and bent, so that's lovely. Or no, it's a sticker, I think. So it's a Joker sticker, or no, a Jack, and it's got a bunch of dinosaurs on it. But as you can see, it's all bent and destroyed, so that's kind of lame. Um, oops, sorry, I keep dropping things. June 2016 Survival. That's what this month was, and it supposedly had a Fallout thing, but you can see on the pin there, it's got that stupid little fox. I don't get what this whole thing is with them with the fox and the... And that's, uh... Supposed to be Rick. So we did get a Fallout item, and it's... A little keychain with a... Like, little cutesy-looking Vault Boy, which... Eh. Um... Vault keychain. So the Bioshock you could have got... Four different ones. You could have got Booker with the shotgun, which I got Booker with the skyhook, Little Sister, or Elizabeth. Little Sister would have been cool. Uh, there's a Jurassic sticker card, which mine came destroyed, so that's cool. Is it a sticker, or is it just a card that came bent and ripped up? I thought it was a sticker. Nah, it's definitely a sticker. Okay. Uh, you get the ball keychain, the survivor key cover, and the Jurassic Dead mashup. Um... Mm. Mm. I mean, one of boxes have been kind of letting me down the past two months. Uh, usually they're pretty good. Usually I'm pretty pumped about the boxes, but the past two months, uh, like this is cool. But the problem is, if you're a Bioshock fan or if you're a pop fan, you probably already have it. And I would have had it if it wasn't for the fact that I just not, never got around to it, so I got lucky. And I've been kind of not as into Pops as I was, so that's the other thing. If you're still, like, huge into Pops like I was, you know, a while ago, like, I would have had that already. And most people who are fans of Bioshock or Pops probably have that already. Like I said, the shirt, eh. It could have been cooler if the T-Rex looked more zombified, like, then it would have made more sense, but the T-Rex just looked normal. And then the key cover, I mean, that's a cool thing, but I'm not going to use it. And then the little Vault Boy keychain, like, I'll fall out, but I don't know, it's too cutesy. It kind of just looks like a, it honestly just looks like a baby on your keychain. Like, I feel like you have to be a, definitely be a Fallout fan and know that that's Vault Boy. You have to get, like, a good look at it, otherwise it's just like I have a baby on my keychain. And, um, that was it. And the, the card. But the card's like a little cheap sticker that came destroyed. So, yeah, I... Better than last month's, if I recall last month's correctly, but still not the best. So, hopefully they pick it up. Otherwise, I might be done with 1UP Box and just stick with Loot Gaming. Because Loot Gaming has been really, really good. And that's the whole reason I got 1UP on the box in the first place. It was supposed to be more gaming oriented. And it's 
been kind of lacking lately. So we'll see what next month brings. Hopefully they pick it back up because I do like the box. I do like what they've, what some of the things I've gotten from the box. It's just lately it's been eh. So uh, anyway, guys, as always, thanks for watching my video supporting me. Let me know in the comments below what you thought of the box. Did you like it or were you kind of eh on it like I was? Uh, like I said, thanks for watching my videos and supporting me. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Later, guys.